Jones. Well, Bob, I do hope you aren't afraid of heights. Let's go gliding. Oh, look, there he is right up there.
This week, our first letter comes from viewer David Bendelow. He writes, Dear fellow footage detectives, Noel and Mike, it's like chatting to friends sitting in my lounge every Sunday at 5 p.m. Uh, Noel, I'd love to see the valiant years about Churchill's bodyguard broadcast on Talking Pictures TV. Can you make it happen? Well, I, uh, yes, uh, I suppose if they've <laughs> got enough money, why not? Yeah, I mean, you can't always get everything you no, want. No. Sometimes you can get it quickly, sometimes it takes a year, sometimes it's not possible to get at all. Yeah, you know, it's, it's sometimes it's under licence to someone else. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, it's only if, if you want it, you think it's worthwhile, and somebody's willing to sell. And, if a and we think enough done. people will want to watch it because yeah. um, the nice will in the world, you know, we, we, we have to get as many people watching it as possible. It's a difficult decision to make because quite often it's very easy to just to pick things that you like and you've got to stand aside from that from things that you'd personally like to what the viewers would like. Yeah, I, I've, I've struggled with that. But, but I, I, having worked in more or less all the facets of film production, I, I put my technical hat on. And if the film technically is good, you can then worry about um, certain you know, the actors, the storyline, and so on and so on.